and it was met with real force by midfielder Sonder von der Streek. He delivered his first since November's 5-0 thrashing of De Grasca, getting to the ball ahead of Daniel Schwab. The perfect start for Abacar after a week in which he'd been offered the job at Feyenoord next season, only to turn it down after plenty of negative reaction from their fans. And given Utrecht's rotten recent record, there was much to prove in this game. That was a view he stuck to after the game too, having seen things again, although the Dutch FA announced they disagreed with the official. No doubt PSV also disagreed with the referee over the next key incident in the game, one which saw Utrecht break to score a second. Lozano looked to have been shoved over by Van Overheim. Van Buchel suggested that Utrecht midfielder got the ball. Van der Streek's long ball earned him an assist as Kirk raced away to score. The fifth goal in nine Eredivisie games for him. Van Bommel directed his anger straight at the fourth official, Edwin van der Graaf. No doubt in his mind that it should have been a foul. And it did seem to have been Lozano's touch that moved the ball away. That was something Van Bommel also expressed to the assistant on the touchline, although he was too busy keeping up with play to stop and take notice. It was a fine finish from Kjalk at full speed, and with Hendrik sliding towards him. The slightest brush off the toes of keeper Jurin Zud only helped it nestle in the corner. No doubt Ajax were cheering as loudly as those fans inside Utrecht Stadion Galgenvart. Van Bommel was also loud, but was soon bigger. Coming into this game, he'd already managed 18, which was six more than last season although not in the first meeting between these two. Here, his movement kept the home back line on their toes, while PSV's passing pulled around the players in front of them. And when Bergwijn eventually released him, his shot had enough power on it to dribble over the line. Rather than getting stuck in that boggy goal mouth. Jensen nearly got enough of a deflection to make it stick, but the PSV captain moved on to 19 goals, and his side got a step closer to at least taking a point from the game. PSV did do it again, though, once more striking late to give themselves some reward from the game, and Utrecht had their chances to clear, but made a mess of it, much to Abacar's frustration. He felt they should have been able to hold on and manage the game to a successful conclusion. But Gavarri's clearance went only as far as Dumfries, whose barracking run into the box set up a final big moment for De Jong. And he didn't disappoint, sliding into claim goal number 20 in the league and a point for his side. Their lead increased to six rather than eight points over Ajax, but it's still a healthy one. And still reason enough for fans of the Amsterdam club to get frustrated all over again.